flight boss, bitch. Yeah, it's the mind of an Antares moon. I'm the Archangel Uriel, and I'm here on Earth to carry out God's duties and responsibilities. You know, for sure. Hey, you know, um, I wanted to make a quick video on gravity because, um, you know, gravity isn't something hard to understand. And you got a lot of scientists and shit like that who overcomplicate things to make it seem like it is harder to understand than what it really is. And see, the, the, the way scientists is trying to figure out gravity and the way they was trying to figure out relativity and shit, they're looking, they're barking up the wrong tree. So all the information that they manifest themselves from it to try to apply it, to try to make it make sense, is the only thing they're going to come up with. When in reality, gravity is nothing more, nothing less than the relationship of all the particles in the sky uh, circling around each other. Like Now, the question here is, the question, the question isn't what's gravity. The question is, what started the direction of the movements? Because gravity is, is simply just the relationship of the all the particles in the sky. We're in a particle. Earth. Earth is a particle. See, we get naive to the fact because we're so small. Like, So we get naive to the fact and we over-exaggerate of the possibilities of what this gravity is really, really is. But gravity, we can see gravity in a form of a... Um, in the form of air and wind and stuff like that. It's simply, see, when we, when, put it like this. Say you got two, say you got some dice in your hands, right? And you throw the dice on the ground. Now, to you, the reason why as a human and being a scientist is so naive to the fact of what's really going on is because the relationship with us and the dice it's so fast and it seems like we already know that's going to happen so we don't have to look into that anymore it seemed like we like figured that out why like the dice hit the ground real fast we we know what's going to occur when we do it because we're here you know what i'm saying but we fail to realize that the small the smallest objects that's on them dice the actual time it took for you to throw the dice and for it to hit the ground to the smallest aspects on that dice. I mean, to particles that you won't be able to see, not even with a microscope, but they're there. Even to some degree, the shit you can see with microscopes. To them, that might have been years. It, it might have took a year. It might have took. Like, the smaller the particle is to the dice that you threw on the ground, it might have hit the ground in 1.2 seconds to us. Now, to the smallest beings and particles on that dice, that process from your hand to the ground might have been two to 3,000 years or even more than that. Made it might have been to, to the smallest particles, beings on that dice. That process from your hand to the ground may have been a hundred thousand years that they might have had millions of revolutions through that so you get the concept i'm, I'm kind of going right now the qu the question isn't what's gravity the question is what caught what was the first initiation of the direction that all these planets is going in in order to them for them to the relate because we look at it like this the sun is slow, it moves around it, whatever like that. But say all the planets, like we're in one and shit, say that was dice. And say it was a, a being way larger than us that threw that dice. Now, we're saying something that's a 2,000 years is slow to us. Maybe just be a split second to something else that's out there. You know what I'm saying? So just build on that, you know what I'm saying? And then I hope scientists really find out who the flight boss is one day too because maybe they'll be able to watch a video from an archangel and then understand 
different concepts and perceptions of how to look at things so we're not actually making things up as we see. Like, we can sit here and try to figure out what a particle is and think we figured out what a particle is, but all we did was make up something in our own mind what a particle may be and and apply and apply scientific measures for it to make sense to what we made up. So really, we just making sense out of what we made up, and none of it may not be true. So just build on that, you know what I'm saying? Flight boss, bitch. <laughs>